Alright, Kahalala, Yahweh, Basham, Yahweh Shai, Basham, Makakodash, the Balanas unto the Apostles at GMS, who rule well and teach well, and salutations unto the brothers and your few sisters that take heed, shall want to the elect. Alright, may Yahweh Shai be with you. Um, uh, I just want to make a quick video on uh, this uh, the video I seen yesterday on, uh, again, uh, I've, I've used this as a platform before for a lesson, uh, Joe Rogan. Um, the guy that was from uh, Fear Factor and um, a long time uh, UFC commentator. And uh, he has his own podcast and he brings various people. He has this guy over now uh, called Tim Kennedy, which he was in the Special Forces and whatnot. And, um, you know, he, uh, he went, you know, he's been around the world and he's seen and done things, right? So... He has this new show called Finding Hitler, where they basically go into um, whether or not Hitler disappeared after World War II. You know, because the story of it is that he died, he committed suicide in the bunker, killed the wife, the dog, and all that shit. But he, in the show, they de they debunk that, and they uh, basically, um, you know, follow that. And I believe it's three seasons, he, he said. I haven't watched the show myself, but I was watching the interview. This video is good. You can just watch this video, you know, for brothers. I'm not going to play the video, but uh, you 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 could uh, uh, watch it or whatnot. And then, um, what do you call it? When uh, when you watch the video, he uh, uh, the guy, Tim Kennedy, breaks it down. Basically, that, uh, what do you call it? You had, in the third season, I believe, that you had Nazi... Uh, SS soldiers and whatnot, tens of thousands, they fled to Argentina, Chile, you know, various places. It wasn't just those places, but that was the majority. A lot of them went over, over to Argentina, to uh, Chile. Um, and basically, um, they went to other places, you know, like Honduras, Costa Rica, and you had a thing called Project Paperclip. I brought that out like a lot of times. Because it was important that, you know, people understood that when, when you had these, uh, these teemen, all right, the Germans, the teemenites, these uh, demons, man, the Germans, man, they, 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 they did a lot of wickedness, right? They did a lot of wickedness when they came to the Project Paperclip. You had America and, and, and Russia fighting over them. And... Um, you know, because the Germans, they had the technology, right? They were more technologically advanced. And that's something in the podcast that this guy, Joe Rogan, even he brings out. You know, in the video, I'm not going to give everything away, but he's like, basically, you know, drive a BMW from the 80s and, you know, uh, in, a, in an American car or even just, just any German car from the 80s. An American car from the 80s, you can't compare it, you know? And um, basically... <clears throat> yeah, in the video, basically he's, he's going into that, that they went over there and they set up till, to, till this day they have colonies there. All right, these demons, they got colonies over there. And even before that, you had uh, uh, the same things happening uh, in South America. You had uh, uh, these demons, these again, Timonites, the Germans, they were torturing uh, indigenous children there, uh, Ch uh, Chileans and Argentinians, which is a tribe of Neftali. Same thing when through pa Project Paperclip, when they came over to Canada, to the US, they were conducting experiments upon kids from residential schools. And those documents and that information is declassified, man. Go look it up. All right, brothers did countless videos on that. That's, that's not common, I was about to say common, that's not common inf knowledge or information, but it's out there. But um, same thing was happening in uh, Argentina, in Chile. We had these hospitals set up where they would um, experiment on kids and, and, and all this shit. You know, they would, set, they would do all, these, all this shit for decades, man. If they had a, you know, the strong Jake kid, you know, a child, they would, 
they would experiment, man. You know, they light like in the video, the man talks about it, you know, he talks about how they would light you on fire, nurse you back to health, throw you out a window, you know, see how many broken bones you get, nurse you back to health, you know, do do some other shit. Basically torture, man. You know? It's basically goddamn torture. So that's what they're conducting and doing. Um, in the video, it's very good. And uh, like I said, today, you even have colonies down there, man. You have whole German towns. And he said today, there's th the descendants of these devils, um, there's, there's hundreds of thousands of them down there, man. So you, these devils, man, you, you, you Edomites, you're gonna, you're gonna be rooted up, man. When they let get their power, you're gonna be rooted up. You know, you're gonna be rooted. You're gonna be found all, in, all the crevices, man. You're gonna be found throughout wherever the fuck you are, man. You know, you're gonna be found out, man. You know, As a matter of fact, I'm gonna get that scripture. Um. What is it? In, uh, I believe the book of Amos. Right, Amos 9. Right, I'll start at verse 2. It says, uh, it says, though they dig into hell, then shall my hand take them. Though they climb up to heaven, then shall I bring them down. And that's basically going into what these elites are preparing for, you know. And the and these and these top elites, they have their plans. They have their bunkers. They have their space stations. You know, they have their various uh, uh, setups. You know, for or what they call bug outs. Verse 3, and though they hide themselves in the top of Carmel, which is a mountain, right? I will search and take them out thence, man. So all these crevices, man, all these fucking places that that um, that you devils are hiding in, the most is going to find you out, man. Okay? All them colonies in Argentina, the most is going to put the spirit on the, they call them the, the Mapuche Indians, which he had a lot of resistances down there in Argentina and Chile. The Mosai is going to put the spirit on the Mapuches to, to, to fuck you guys up, man. Just like the Mammites are doing in, in South Africa, messing up you Edomites. The Mosai is going to put that spirit on them to do the same thing. It's going to be beautiful, man. Same up here with Gad. All right? These, you're talking about these devils, man. You know? They have all this plush, great land. And then they want more land. And then they, and then they start taking it. You know? And all they do is push alcohol and drugs on your reservations, man. That's why you have all this... Crystal meth epidemic, fentanyl epidemic, you know? Ruben, Issachar. Issachar is going to fuck you devils up, man, in Mexico. In Cancun, when you devils have your uh, vacation soirees and all that shit. Most is going to put the spirit on them tribes, man, and pounce on you, man. You know? And it all starts with Judah, right? And though they be hid from my sight in the bottom of the sea, then will I command the serpent, you shall bite them, man. And I, I, man, I, I pray I could see that somehow. That, that'd be a crazy f spectacle to see, man. Leviathan drawing these devils out, man. You know? And they have all these things, man. They have, they study. Esau, like Apostle Tahar said years ago, man, years ago. There's, there's certain Edomites that all they do is study, man. They don't, they don't pop, they're not into women. They're not into, you know, the baseball game. They're not into, they're both learning and studying, man. Why do you think it says in, um, it describes Esau as wiser than Daniel? There's no secret that can, uh, uh, you can hide from them, right? Because they study, man, that's what they do. That's their thing, right? It says... Uh, yeah, that was the point. All right. So again, watch the video. Again, this is just a short video to point out. You know, um, it's crazy, man. Yeah, like I said, they have communities down there where um, it's only German speaking. You know, and even the guy in the video, Tim Kennedy, which he's an Irish dude, he could be a Jake, but he was like, oh shit, basically like um, uh, when you go down there, 
to uh, was at, uh, Buenos, Aires, uh, Buenos Aires. He said about how basically, um, you know, you, you try to speak Spanish down there, and you know they're talking to German. And basically, they have communities. They have a, one called the Bavarian community, where it's nothing but Germans, man. And again, they own that land. They bought that land, actually, so-called. You know, because Jake at the top, or a lot of them is even uh, Edomite conquistadors that, that are running it, man, over there in Argentina and Chile, all right? So again, I didn't want to tear you, just bring that out. It's a good video, good watch, 18 minutes, not too long. You know, check it out. Do, do other response videos, maybe go into the history. Maybe I might go into the history and look it up because it's, it's worth it, man. You know, there's a lot of atrocities these devils did upon our people, man. And the Most High is going to find it out more and more. And, with, and it's our duty, it's our job to bring these things out to light. You see? All right, so with that, I want to say, All right, double honors unto the apostles of GMS, who I learned the truth from. All right, the great men. Salutations unto your brothers and your few sisters that take heed. All right, uh, Shalom.